What's going on, everybody? I uh, took the morning to take care of a couple of things. I still got to run some errands and shit. I, I even got to tackle Ikea today. <laughs> got to bedazzle the house. But anyway, um, there's a couple of things I want to put out today, so I'll try to do in a couple of videos fast. Um, first, let me just recap the AMC video I did yesterday. A lot of people are not understanding that I'm not saying the AMC cannot run up. It's a stock that's going to have, obviously, the, the typical stock dynamics that are happening. I just wanted to tell people that the reality is we still have a very big problem in that stock as far as Popcorn having the shares. That Okay, all the dynamics are going to happen again. The same cast of characters are all going to come out again. The only thing that's going to be different now is you're not going to have, let's say, for example, Popcorn. I mean, then again, he, he has the, in his soul, he'll come back out and be like, I'm with the apes. He hasn't called us apes in a while, hasn't he? But nonetheless, you have to understand this time around, I think people are smart enough that when the, the stock price goes up, they understand that AMC is nothing but a trap because of the CEO and the board the way it is. And all they want to do is dilute shares. All they want to do is drop shares. You know, at the end of the day, the company hasn't done anything for its retail shareholders. The board hasn't. So it's that type of a company. Now, somebody said to me earlier today, why don't we just drop that stock and move on? Well, I would love to. There's a problem. A lot of people are trapped behind enemy lines. They're caught really negative. They got in at 35, 40, 50. So how do we turn around and help them? Well, simple. In order for them to be helped, we have to basically keep an eye on what obviously the powers that be and AMC are going to do, which is what? They're going to dump those shares. They got those shares for a reason. They got the vote to dilute at any time. So now, what that means is I... Like I tell everybody before, I don't trust this stock at all. Once it makes up a run, I'm going to pull out because I have to wash my hands to this stock. As far as people like taking losses and stuff like that, you decide what's best for you. But understand, as long as Popcorn has shares, he's going to drop them. And if he doesn't have shares and he doesn't get voting rights for new shares, he's going to come out with another preferred equity unit. And then he's going to do a reverse split again. This is so predictable, it's not even funny. I'm just trying to tell people, yes, it will go up in price, but at the end of the day, the MOAS, they got the solution for the MOAS. They got the solution for the MOAS in AMC, GTI, COSM, uh, Mullen, um, MMTPD, GameStop. They have the solution for the MOAS. Understand something. That was created by them. Do you understand what I'm trying to tell you? It's not that the stock doesn't have the potential to go up with typical market dynamics, but the problem is... They know how to stop it. A reverse split. <laughs> pulling, pulling the stock. You get MMT, LP, whatever, the whole thing. Look at Bed Bath & Beyond. Perfect example. Listen, the market is not legit by any way, shape, or form. Nobody's protecting us. All I can tell you is with AMC, prepare yourself, protect yourself, and please plan to do what you have to do because it's that type of a stock. So you already know this. So that's video one.